<laughs> Good morning. Um, I ran into my neighbor heading out. And, um, it seems silly. It seems really silly. <laughs> but, um, she told me that her cat, Totan, <laughs> Daddy, actually passed away yesterday. And there were flowers on his um, favorite spot. And she started crying. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's probably the empath in me. I have to be upset right now. <laughs> But I did ask how old, and she said, oh, we think he was 20 years old. And I just think, oh. I want Vanilla and Izuki to have such a long life. All right, I got to get to the station. I got to get to work. Oh. Recipes, Chotan. Yay for being off work. I'm feeling better as you can tell. Um, yeah, I took a taxi to work and the taxi driver, well, he knew where I was going and so he asked me if I was an English teacher. I said yes and he said, can I ask you just one bit of English? I'm like, okay, shoot. Um, he said, you know, there's the highway. I'm like, yes. He's like, not the highway, like this road. What would you say? General road. And I said, normal roads, um, side streets. Uh, <laughs> and I just said, normal, standard. Because um, if you take the highway here, it's a toll road. So I didn't know what to tell him, but it's interesting. Um, he also stopped the meter further back so it wouldn't be so expensive <laughs> and I'm like oh um I told hubby about Tochan that Tochan passed away yesterday and um he said oh we just moved like this is two weeks he's like oh I thought I was gonna see lots of Tochan in the neighbor's yard and it's so sad and I'm like I know and I really think I was just feeling my poor neighbor's emotions today. You know, she loved, she loves the cats. But, um, yeah, 20 years though, pretty long life for a cat. Uh, I did have one little issue in class. A student um, pulled out his overall grades for this last term. And he said, why is my grade so low? And he has really, really, really good English. So I'm like, I don't know. It shouldn't be this slow. Let me check. <laughs> See if I made a mistake. And I thought maybe I wrote on the, the latest test. I wrote 90. But it was written in such a way that I might have seen it as the way I write a 6. And so I'm like, oh, did I give him like 60 instead of 90? Ah. Well, it turns out the very first grade that I entered I put in his seat number instead of the actual grade because you know you're thinking uh, like okay this is you know number 22 number 22 and okay there's number 22 and I wrote 22 not thinking like that kind of thing so his grade is going to bump up but I have to figure out because it sounds like we can't change it I just have to credit him the difference in the next grading so I'm not sure how that will work but when I talk to the head English teacher he actually teaches that class next so he's gonna tell him for me so I'm like yay I can go home speaking of which I'm hungry I want to go eat lunch and get home
Yeah. Hello, I'm home. Uh, hubby's on his way home too. I stopped by at the store to get uh, a couple of things uh, for lunch slash and dinner tomorrow. Um, I have a special tutoring uh, session for Aiken test, the English equivalent, no, English um, test, like a nationally um, uh, acknowledged uh, leveling of how good your English is for uh, some of my students. Uh, there's an interview process for part of it. And um, yeah. It's from, it's like 4.30 to 6.10, so like almost two hours. Um, so I'm going to get home late, but I'm going to probably have an early lunch and early dinner, like before the class, because I can't, like, I'll get dizzy and I can't wait until I'm home at like 8 or 9. <laughs> but it is Friday, another weekend upon us, so yay. Uh, okay, let's do some things that should be done before hubby gets home. Meow. Uh, it's that time again to kind of close the video for today. Uh, almost 8 p.m. Hubby is up, uh, falling asleep, uh or sleeping. I'm kind of tired, but I think I'm going to check a few YouTube videos or maybe an episode of Shit's Creek, I don't know. While we were watching Sailor Moon, Hubby had a Suki on his lap. Vanilla, I kind of put down uh, in between us and uh, Azuki just leaned over face to face with Vanilla where before the move, she would hiss at him, growl at him, and then jump down and run away. She looked at him and started licking his face. It was so cute. It was adorable. Um, and I looked up what cats, there we go, what cats licking kind of means. And um, one of the things I read is a lot of the more dominant cat will lick the mm, subordinate cat. Like, so definitely with this move, Azuki has started feeling more confident and seeing, I think, Vanilla be scared of things. He, he lost points and she's not afraid of him. And that's a good thing because she had no reason to be afraid of him. Oh so my I don't want it to go away. I'm scared it'll go away. But yeah, very happy. Um, yeah, I gotta relax. Anyways, that's gonna be it for today. And I will um, see you guys pretty sure tomorrow. But it is a long day. And we'll see how I feel. But so far so good, right? Alright, until next time. Ja. Oh, <laughs>